Hope y'all are doing well this morning. Today is Monday, September 26th. And this morning in our devotional, it says secret regrets. 1 Corinthians chapter 7, verse 10. For godly grief produces a repentance that leads to salvation without regret, whereas worldly grief produces death. 1 John chapter 1, verse 9. If we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us our sins and cleanse us from all unrighteousness. Romans 10, verse 10. For it is with your heart that you believe and are justified, and it is with your mouth that you profess your faith and are saved. Psalm chapter 51, verse 19. You will be pleased with sacrifices offered in the right spirit. Luke chapter 17, verse 4. If he sins against you seven times in a day and turns to you seven times, saying, I repent, you must forgive him. Ephesians chapter 1, verse 7. In him we have redeem redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of sins, according to the riches of his grace. Hebrews chapter 5, verse 8 and 9. Even though Jesus was God's son, he learned obedience from the things he suffered. In this way, God qualified him as a perfect high priest, and he became the source of eternal salvation for all those who obey him. And at the bottom, it says, the Holy Spirit will reveal sin in your life. While the devil will accuse you of your sin, true repentance is much more than just a quick apology. It is the belief that what you have done, said, or even thought were wrong and you don't defend yourself. But let the Spirit renew your mind. Your words and behavior are now in line with someone who follows the example of Christ. And, of course, that's a good devotional. Um, I'm sure we all have uh, regrets in our lives that we wish we could go back in time and change. Um, and the devil uses them. So we just have to keep in mind that once we have given our life to God and accepted Jesus into our hearts, that we're forgiven for all that. So when the devil comes knocking, saying, hey, you remember when you did this? Uh, don't let it get to you. Don't let him uh, condemn you, okay? You've been forgiven for that past sin already, okay? All right, short and sweet this morning. I don't want to take up everybody's time. I really don't. And uh, I hope you meditate on these scriptures today. Uh, think about these scriptures and that's it that's all I got <laughs> I love you guys um, as always give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down like share and subscribe join me on the disciple server link is in the description um, today is our revelation study group I hope you all join us decide to join us and join in on the conversation uh, and if I don't see you in the next video I hope, I hope very, very soon that we meet in the clouds with Jesus. I love you guys.